All right, hey guys, we're making a password uh, system for a program. So I'm gonna I'm gonna start that. Just go to new projects. When that opens, Windows Forms application, and just wait for it to, to load. I usually forget to name it, but it's not that big a deal. Takes a few seconds to load. Alright. So, I usually just like to check how far it is from loading by just stretching it out, and when it's when it moves freely, then that means that it's good. There we go. Alright, you don't have to make it too big, just about that big. Um, add a button. Button's always important. A, a label. And a text box. Alright, let's make this smaller. Now, it's, th this is really easy to make. Uh, if you know simple coding, the if, else if, or or uh, else commands, then you you'll be good. They're probably one of the most uh, important commands in Visual Basic. So let's name it password. And we'll just try to center that. Button one is going to be submit. We're going to make the form um, fixed 3D. I make it fixed 3D because I, fixed means that you can't like stretch it out and move it around and stuff. Because then that will just look ugly. And uh, 3D just makes this have like a border effect, like like it has these uh, bumping out. So let's make the maximize box false. So you or that's minimize box. My bad. Maximize. All right, here we go. Maximize bo box false. So you can't use this. And let's make it all right. That, that's good. If you want to, you can change the background color. Um, and for right now, that's good. All right. So let's try the coding. Double click on the button, and that will bring you to the coding screen. All right. So think of a password. Uh, that you want to do, and you're gonna write if text box one dot text equals um whatever your password is, then uh form two dot show. And we're gonna add form two in a second. Uh, and then we'll add else if, or not else if, else, just else. Um, and we're gonna put that as um, message box. Um, I I'll explain what this means if you don't understand in a sec. Um, false or no not false we'll name it incorrect uh... message box style dot critical 
and I made a mistake. You want to put that there. I don't say message box critical. And the title will be uh, wrong. So let's make another form. Windows form. We're not going to put anything on that because it's not important. We're just making the password part. You can put your actual program on here. That's it's what if you get the password right, it's going to bring you to here, which is form two. So it's saying right here, if the te text in text the first text box, which is right here, equals the word password. So if I would type password in there, then show this. If if uh, something else is put in there other than the actual password, then a message box will come up saying incorrect, and the message box style I probably spelled this wrong. Yeah. Oops. There we go. And then the message box style equals critical. And that will have like a red X. And the title of the uh, thing, like this where the title would be, will say wrong. So that's that. And if you want to make it like, this is case sensitive. So we're, I, I like to put a ELSIF. E-L-S-E-I-F text box one dot text equals password then uh, form two dot show well, if for those of you that don't know what case sensitive is that means that uh, if it it matters if it's an uppercase or lowercase letter, so lowercase, uppercase. You can put anything in between these, and that's what the password will be. All right. Uh, it's not just specifically the word password. That's just an example. So now what it's saying is if the text in the text box equals the word password, then form two dot show, which is it just shows this form. Otherwise, uh, put a message box saying incorrect with a style of critical. Um, but you can also have uh, else if, which is basically just the same as if. But it says else if text box one dot text equals password, then form two dot show. So there's that. Um, so let's uh, test it. All right, so let's let's try this out. See if it works. Uh, password, and then submit, and it shows form two. Uh, there's that. And then let's try it with a lowercase letter. Password, submit, and it works. So that's how you make. A basic um, uh, password program and uh, thanks for watching guys uh, and check out my other videos